Hi there. I have a question. Hi, I have a question. I I, are you aware of the number of affairs that are having in the community? I'm sorry? Are you aware of the number of affairs they're having in the community? It says community mean, affair. affairs. Well, you know how people have affairs. When they have a, an affair with somebody if they're married and then they have an affair with somebody. Oh, so who are you with? Oh, I'm just with myself. And I saw the sign, Community Affairs. And I thought, if I could get that number. Hey guys, News Now California, out in the city of Santa Monica. I am at the Santa Monica Public Safety Facility, which houses the police department and fire administration. I'm out here today with San Joaquin Valley Transparency and Nate Skates 182. So we've got a police uh, truck up here with a mounted surfboard. Must be nice, huh? Got a nice water works here, water fountain. Community affairs here. There's a bone in basic. Public records. Are these complaint forms? This is how you record this stuff. Oh, here. Cool. Thank you. Yeah, last night I was talking about. These guys like to So community affairs they've got a big copying machine here or not copying I don't know what you call that machine. Hi there. I have a question. Hi. Hi, I have a question. I, I, are you aware of the number of affairs that are having in the community? I'm sorry? Are you aware of the number of affairs they're having in the community? It says community affairs. Well, you know how people have affairs. When they have a, an affair with somebody if they're married and then they have an affair with somebody. Oh, so who are you with? Oh, I'm just with myself. And I saw the sign, Community Affairs. And I thought, if I could get that number. There's not a lot of them. I wouldn't know. Okay. All right, just checking. Because you don't want to have a lot of affairs in the community because it makes the community look bad. <laughs> well. She didn't like that. Traffic services, here's a picture of them giving a DUI.
to a man, finger, finger, nose finger. Please ring bell for service. Here they are pushing a guy here or holding him to do the walk. What's cracking over here, buddy? Not much. Well, what do we have back here? More uh, plaques here. Machines, how much are these? Dollar bills. It doesn't say how much it is. What? 25 cents? No, there's no way. A dollar 25, that's what it is. See, they have numbers here. It says like, uh, what is it, D2, 10 cents? No, there needs to be a one before here. That's all false advertisement. Like right here, you see it? A dollar 25, C4. That is good. These are all correctly marked. This one's free. This one's zero, zero. All right. They need to fix that machine. Okay, here's more uh, plaques and badges. Well, I think I might go on the website to find out how many affairs are happening in the community, but I'm, I don't even think they're gonna print that information. If, if the woman working in community affairs can't tell me how many affairs are in this community, then they're probably not putting it on the website. You would think she would have known what a, uh, an affair is. Fire department and administration, preventive operations. Here we go. How's it going, brother? Good. Good, man. Apparently, to be a fireman in this department, there is no height requirement, as you can see from this guy. Three, four, five, six, seven. They probably got ten pictures up there of fire personnel. Probably the chief is up there. Here's some more statues, they have figurines. City Hall 2020. This is conducting business. Hi, you guys been helped? Yeah, yeah we're good. Okay, you guys, what are you guys, part of something with the cameras? Um, yeah. Yeah, part of something? No, we're just out filming. Oh, okay. Yeah. Do, do you need help or anything, or do you guys... No, I answer that. We don't need any help. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm just curious, because we never had cameras in here before. That's okay. All. Well, here we are with cameras, brother. <laughs> all right. <laughs> There's always a first time for everything. That's right. Um, anything I can do for you guys? Any questions I can answer? No, we're good. Okay. Unless you have a free buffet and tell us what time it is. <laughs> we don't have that, okay. unfortunately. Okay, well, that's the only question I have. Okay, are you guys going to be here long? Uh, after we conduct our business... I mean, we're not going to be here all day. Okay. You know, we're not we're not all in right. here to impede business. No, no, I'm not saying that. It's just unusual for cameras to be in here. That's all. It's, oh, it's okay. you know, our employees here. 
Right, don't with your public react. officials. Absolutely. And nobody has a right of expectation. Absolutely from, not. Uh, no, you guys are welcome to stay here and film all day. I just don't you. know. I just It's just yeah. awkward, that's all. Yeah, you guys can understand if I started filming you guys, it'd be weird. Well, you are filming us. That's, that's, one of well, the reasons okay. why we do right? this is because we want to get rid of that fear factor. Oh, okay. Yeah. If like, there's nothing going on, we're transparent enough, then you guys can film us all day long. It's right. public property, but... Like I said, I just don't want our gals startled, startled by a bunch of cameras because we well, don't they, have that on a daily yeah, basis. You, they've heard the conversation. There's no reason to be startled. Okay. That's all I was asking, man. Yeah, it's all good. Let us know if you need any help. I, well, I do have a question. Yes. Um, do the cameras, like inside the buildings and outside the buildings, does that startle the, the, the public officials? I don't know that we have cameras inside the building. I've, I've, only, I've been here a year in this office and we don't have... Well, there's, yeah. yeah, there's buildings all around. There's cameras all around the building, in and out. Yeah, that's security purposes for the officers and for the employees here, but that doesn't startle them. But See, I think the, the, the cameras, like whether it's on, whether it's mounted on the wall or mounted in someone's hand, it could be for security purposes. Absolutely, right? yeah. No, but I think tr what's what's interesting is when you when there's somebody holding a camera in your face, like right now. People are going, hey, what the heck? Because that's not a normal. But it's normal to have security on buildings or, or houses sure, sure. and stuff right, like right. that. Right, well, so that's the if, if I can interject, when sure, you absolutely. say it's not normal to have people uh, put a camera in your face, it wasn't in your face. You walked up to us. No, I know. But I mean, what I'm saying is people. there are three people holding a camera pointing at me or, or our, our staff. Right. It's just not normal. We don't have that every day. Okay. Where every day we walk by a building and we know that we're being watched. Right, right. You know, with, well, with today's security. Thursday. Maybe tomorrow you'll have it. Maybe. And then you won't be startled. <laughs> um, do you think that maybe uh, this might be something that in the near future maybe that maybe um, everyone might start getting used to it? Not cameras like this, I don't think. Unless so you, you're paparazzi. You, so do you think that uh, a person holding a camera will never be, ex like, maybe not acceptable is not the word to use, but... Um, comfortable. Comfortable. But if you're comfortable, if you know what it's for, right. but I don't know that it's... I think it's uncomfortable if you don't know what it's for. So that's why I asked you, is there anything I can help you with or is there anything that you need from us? What is this for? So if you knew what it was for, I think it'd be 100%. If, if I'm on camera, on the news camera, and I'm the PIO, and we're talking about an incident, 100%, I think it's, it's legit. So if somebody doesn't know um, what something is for, does that make that thing bad? No, it doesn't make it bad, but it makes it uncomfortable. uncomfortable. So we're back to uncomfortable, right? Yeah, so, so in other words, if this is a, 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 a First Amendment protected activity, and a lot of people, say for instance, people like myself, mm -hmm. and people like my viewers and supporters who want to know exactly, maybe that not this easy. place right here, but other that down or someone that wrote that overspend tax dollars and they're hiding and stuff like gotcha. that. Yeah. So okay. when we come and ask questions, yeah, sometimes people like me, yeah. um, they, they say, oh, this guy's causing a disturbance. Oh, because no, he's asking that. questions that we really don't want I think to if you're answer. afraid of answering those questions, you right. could be 100% right. So, so yeah. sometimes right. when we bring cameras into places like this, yeah. it, it basically almost completely stops all that. Oh, no, we're not afraid of that. No, no, you might not be. No, I think us in this office up here, I don't think you find that i think i think we'd be you right, right, we'd right. welcome you in right. because we don't have nothing to hide but i think right. it's just un, it's still uncomfortable to have cameras and people because you don't know what it's for so well, um, this is unscripted and that's pretty good because you're getting information you need right right exactly. i get it there you and go I tell you what, man you guys are going to get really good um this this place is going to get really good reviews you guys might get some phone calls uh just saying thank you guys for you got it man special, especially you man yeah what was you your got name it? james james David. yep you got it man all oh, right Phil. What's it? Phil. Phil, nice to meet so you, So just to share you a quick story, uh, we did the same thing at Malibu City Hall, uh -huh. and one of the city engineers uh, came out, and he shined a green laser on us just because ah. he didn't want to be filmed. Yeah. I, hey, I, like I said, man, I think my, the, the staff here, they, they got nothing to hide. They're just doing their work, and we're just trying to yeah. provide a good service to the citizens. And right on. Be my guest, man. If you have any more questions, let okay. them know. I'm in a meeting right now, but let them know, and they'll come and get me. Uh, sounds All good, right. James. Just pass the word out. If they anybody sees us here, don't shine a green laser on us. <laughs> we won't do that. Thank you. All right. All right. Take care. All right. Well, they respected our right to film. James answered all the questions. And that's what it is. It's all a fear factor. Why everybody has a fear factor? Because they don't know what we're filming for. But he was cordial. He handled it uh, professionally the way it should be handled.
And I don't know if you guys have commendation forms as well. Is it separate? Yeah, you can do both online actually. commendation. But do you have a com uh, commendation form? Basically, recording the phone with me, phone public officials accountable, make sure it's their people's rights and stuff like that. You know, the camera saves you from not sometimes getting in trouble, you know? Check out what we do, man. Take yourself, protect your family, empower yourself. Empower your family. Uh, always have a camera. If you have a phone, call your number. Just report to them. You know what I'm saying? You got, you got the recording? Get a hold of me. Get a hold of me. We can put them on blast. Big time. Write down my... Uh, write down my email address, man. We can help you, man. Make changes. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what you're doing. Really? So what you want to do is put your video on YouTube. Reach out to us or or hacktivists go out and do this. I came here, recorded it, and they took my phone. Yeah. Did they see the recording? See me recording? Did they see the recording? No, you're recording the the, the recording that you have. No. You haven't showed it to anyone yet. L.A. Sheriff's, huh? L.A. Sheriff's, mess no, with? Devonshire Police. Okay. Oh, Devonshire. Mm -hmm. Weren't we just there? Yeah, we were just there. there. Police departments in, in the Northridge. Yep, we were just up there. Aren't, the, are the, aren't yeah, those the ones that were pulling everybody over in the little detective area? Detective Webb, specifically. Yep. And then, um, yeah, and then they got one. And then also when I was um, when I was in there, speaking of the detectives, I don't, they didn't know I was recording, but they were, they were like, um, he was like, yeah, we, we, we're pulling everyone over for registration. Because I asked him why they put me over. Because my tags were fine. Uh, like he, got, he must have got caught. You right got there. caught, man. When? A week was ago? Was it a motorcycle cop? Uh, no, I wasn't a motorcycle cop. But they were, he, he pulled me over for my, he said he pulled me over for my tags. But my tags are clearly, you know, had the stickers on it. Where? Devonshire Reseda Boulevard? Uh, Devonshire, it was on Balboa and, and Nordoff. And um, cause basically, I felt like he put me over for no reason. Cause I like, why'd you put me over? He just saw four black guys in the car. Yeah, he that's like, it. He said he put me over because of my tags, but my tags clearly had the sticker on it. He said like, I just was checking registration. But when I went to the police station, he was like, yeah, we're just we're just randomly pulling everyone over. Yeah. And just for registration. That's against. Um, that's against your. He's like we. He's like we're, He's like we're making the tow company so much money because we're just we're just pulling yeah, the, people. It's racial profiling. Bef without knowing, without knowing that their registration, he just just hoping or just checking right. something. Like they were hoping that my registration wasn't well. Wow, so man, I, that's interesting. But give me a. I'm sorry. You get them back with this. You have recording. Are you recording us now? Yeah. Just like we are. Did, why did you get butt hurt or something? Huh? But why did you decide to record us? You already have cameras inside here, don't you? What was your name, ma'am? Name badge number? Officer Lucetto, 3917. 3917? Yeah. Lucetto. We're still waiting for that accommodation form. Is it coming? Yeah. Give me just one second. Thanks. Did, did you speak with the supervisor, ma'am? Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and take a report for you. Just give me one second, okay? Thank you. So yeah, like I said, no, nah, they're pretty good though. It was the ones, the ones over in Devon's side there, they're pretty bad. Yeah.
Yeah, no, I definitely do that. I felt like it was in the right hands. In my hands, probably not. But in do the, that. But in the right hands. Record this. Record it. See that? Like, record it. Record the police every day. <laughs> Talking into the body cam. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, you would think that it would have accommodation for him really fast. Hey, Dougie. Nope. I guess there's nobody left to accommodate. They don't want to give accommodation for him down there. It's crazy. All right, guys, so we are out of here. You would think they want to give a accommodation for him, but they failed at that. It's ridiculous. All right, everybody, we are out of here. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye now.